In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. O Lord, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Thank you, dear Lord, for your presence. Thank you, dear Lord, for all the blessings that I receive. Lord, I worship you. Lord, I praise you. Lord, I thank you for being with me, for being my protector, for being my guide every moment of my life, for walking with me, especially during the difficult moments, for being with me in all my life, in my life journey. Thank you, Lord, for everything in my life. Lord, at this moment, I present myself to you and surrender. I ask you to bless me once again, especially with those intentions which I am going to mention to you. Lord, I pray to you from the bottom of my heart for some intentions of healing, for some intentions of favors and a miracle in my life. Dear Lord, at this moment we pray very specially healing of sexual problems. We pray for children in the schools who are having this problem. We pray for all the youth. We pray for married couples. We pray for elders. We pray for each one who is having problem of this type. Lord, bless and heal us. Lord, we rely on you. We trust in you. We ask you to bring peace in our life. We ask you to bring harmony. Besides, make us also channel of peace, channel of love. Dear brothers and sisters, let us take the hymn D44 on page 119. No one can give to me that peace which my risen Lord, my risen King can give. No one can give to me that peace which my risen Lord, my risen King can give. When I look around and see all the things that trouble me and I seem to lose my peace in a world that's not at ease no one can give to me that peace which my risen Lord my risen King can give Says my race and Christ to me, my true peace I give to thee, but not as the world doth give, is my peace that makes one live. No one can give to me that peace which my risen Lord my risen kin can give. No one can give to me that peace which my risen Lord, my risen King can give. Dear brothers and sisters, let us pray through the intercession of dear Mother. Remember, O most gracious Virgin Mary, that never was it known that anyone who fled to their protection, implored the help, sought the intercession, or left the needed, in spite of this confidence, 
I fly into you, virgin of virgins, our mother, to you to be calm before you stand, sinful and sorrowful, O mother of the word incarnate, despise not our petitions, but in thy mercy hear and answer us. Amen. Let us take the Psalm 79. Lord, rouse up your might and come to our help. O shepherd of Israel, hear us. You who lead Joseph's flock, shine forth from your cherubim throne upon Ephraim, Benjamin, Manasseh. O Lord, rouse up your might. O Lord, come to our help. God of hosts, bring us back. Let your face shine on us and we shall be saved. Lord of hosts, how long will you frown on your people's plea? You have fed them with tears for their bread an abundance of tears for their drink. You have made us the taunt of our neighbors. Our enemies laugh us to scorn. God of hosts, bring us back. Let your face shine on us and we shall be saved. You brought a wine out of Egypt. To plant it, you drove out the nations. Before it, you cleared the ground. It took root and spread through the land. The mountains were covered with its shadow, the cedars of God with its boughs. It stretched out its branches to the sea, to the great river it stretched out its shoots. Then why have you broken down its walls? It is plucked by all who pass by. It is ravished by the boar of the forest, devoured by the beasts of the field. God of hosts, Turn again, we implore. Look down from heaven and see. Visit this vine and protect it. The vine your right hand has planted. Men have burnt it with fire and destroyed it. May they perish at the frown of your face. May your hand be on the man who have chosen, the man you have given your strength, and we shall never forsake you again. Give us life that we may call upon your name. God of hosts, bring us back. Let your face shine on us and we shall be saved. Glory be to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Lord, rouse up your might and come to our help. Dear brothers and sisters, let us take for our scripture reading from Romans chapter 14, verses 17 to 19. The kingdom of God does not mean eating or drinking, this or that. It means righteousness and peace and joy brought by the Holy Spirit. If you serve Christ in this way, you will please God and be respected by men. So let us adopt any custom that leads to peace and our mutual improvement. The Word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Dear brothers and sisters, I humbly ask you to, to raise your hands and pray for God's blessings. We make a special prayer for healing from sexual problems. We ask our dear Lord to intervene in our lives and to guide us, to guard us and to protect us. Lord, I come before you with the sins of my ancestors. Have mercy on me and deliver me from all forms of sexual problems, especially all negative tendencies towards indecent exposure, rape, fornication, molestation, incest, homosexuality, lesbianism, and perversion. I renounce all bestiality, masochism, sadism, nymphomania, lust, and prostitution in my bloodline. I halt all sexual aggression sexual personality disorders, sexual traumas, and sexually deviant behaviors. 
I command every demon rooted in these patterns of misbehavior in me to leave. In the name of Jesus, I take hold of the sword of the Holy Spirit to cut this chain of evil and break the links. Father, forgive me. Bring sexual health and wholeness into my life. Father, let my bloodline shine with the beauty of healthy sexuality. Let every act of sexual intercourse be pure and pleasing to you. Lord, I bless you, worship you and praise you. Thank you for pouring your light into me, healing me and showering your blessings into my life. Amen. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. Praise you, Jesus. Praise you, Abba Father. Praise you, Spirit of God. Thank you, Mama Mary. Thank you, all the angels and saints. Amen, amen, amen. Let us thank the Lord and praise Him at this moment for His graces and blessings. Let us pray at this time together the Our Father, which our Lord has taught us. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in us now and the hour of our death. Amen. Let us pray. Lord God, true light and creator of light, grant that faithfully pondering on all that is holy, we may ever live in the splendor of your presence. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. Dear brothers and sisters, let us pray at this time for God's mighty intervention. In all our problems, in all our sufferings and struggles in life, the Lord blesses us at this moment. Trust in Him. Let us receive the blessings of our Lord. 